Yo everybody, this is Rock with the Radiant King of the Toy Book and in today's video, go go Power Rangers! I did it man, I finally found her. Trini has been all like so elusive to everybody. Everybody's been going crazy trying to find her and I just randomly went into my uh, target that I, I don't normally go into, it was pretty far away from my target and what was on the shelves? She was, and I was so excited because I am trying to track down all the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I loved them as a kid. Uh, my mom actually just recently gave me a ton of pictures when I was a kid. I had all the Zords. I was such a big fan. I always had a Power Ranger shirt on, and uh, I am purely a nostalgic fan. I am not a buff. I don't know anything about the series other than just the memories and the nostalgia. It, you know, if I don't say the name of something, uh, you know, don't get too offended. It's just. I am just a fan. You know what? People are always complaining that I haven't smashed boxes in a long time. We open boxes on this channel. We don't collect them. So let me... You ready? Let her live. Let her breathe. Trini is one of the coolest Power Rangers, I have to say. She was smart and cool, yet she was tough. And that's usually traits you don't see together. Um, I don't know anyone who had a problem with her character. We're gonna get all this stuff out of here and we're gonna be taking a closer look. So here we are, it's the tray shot. We're gonna take a look at the accessories up close. I find it's easier to look at them in the tray shot. Um, I love that Hasbro is doing the unmasked heads. I think it was such a nice addition. It really shows that they're trying. I feel like Power Ranger line is where Hasbro is trying the most. You know, not so much the Black Series, not so much even Marvel Legends much anymore. Um, but th this line is just awesome, I have to say. So, a beautiful likeness of Trini. Uh, we have the blaster, but it's open. A lot of people are complaining about the open blasters. They want the closed blasters. I'm sure Hasbro will re-release all the set with closed blasters. You know how toy companies are. They gotta make money, it's just business. The two daggers, and then two extra hands, like karate style posed hands, and then two energy effects. Now we're gonna take all this stuff out and we're gonna see how it looks on the figure. So now the first thing that I noticed, no double jointed elbows and no bicep swivels. Like, come on guys, Hasbro. The ladies need love too, man. I'm not even joking. That's, that's messed up. Uh, I'm pretty sure that the uh, male figures had double jointed elbows, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I mean, we do get double jointed knees. We have that, the double ab crunch, which is really nice. The head is pretty nice on here. It's got the, oh, the head popped right off. It's got the look. It's like so nostalgic. I think the yellow is the nicest costume with this design. I don't know. It's just so nostalgic for me. Got nice boots, boot swivel, you know, the, the ankle pivot, everything that uh, you would expect. They got the butterfly joints. You get really nice back posing. You don't get too many in front posing, but it's all right. You know, you, it can make it work, but I, I really can't believe no double jointed elbows. These are karate. Like, uh, the Power Rangers do karate, you know? Like, give them double jointed elbows so they could do it. Uh, here's her head, wow! No wonder why everyone's going crazy, this is her! That likeness is insane! What a beautiful likeness! She looks great on the figure, the hair looks so natural and nice, like, they really did her justice, I gotta say. Very nice. Here, she's got the gripping hand so we could put the daggers in there. Let's see the daggers. Their, their hands are soft plastic, you know, like most Hasbro, so you could, you know, you could get, you could get those silly poses that they always did. Like the Ginyu Force. I love that they, the Power Rangers always had their silly poses and stuff. Um, very cool. Let's see these energy effects. Uh, I think the blade should, the blade should poke into this somewhere. I'm like, I can't see it. Everything is yellow. What the heck? Oh, there it is. I thought I was losing it for a second, guys. Um, put it right there. Oh, now it's coming. All right, you guys get the idea. So, <laughs> there it is. <laughs> She's got the different hands. You know, karate hands right there. You know, like face palm your nose into your skull. And then like a gripping hand. 
Um, the helmet, just look at this. This helmet is so cool, look at that. Really nice. I love these figures, man. The weapon, the blaster is not too detailed, but that's something you could fix. You're not like you should have to fix it, but it's something you could fix. Um, the gun is in there with the blaster is in there. Would have looked better closed. And let's see, did we get everything? Looks like she's doing the fusion dance almost. All right, there you go, guys. I just had to, I just had to um, gush over this figure on camera. Uh, I'm very happy with it. Everybody, be on the lookout. I found it at Target today, and it looked like they just stocked the shelves. So maybe these are getting uh, put out again. I know a lot of people have been going crazy for them. I couldn't even find them online to buy. So. Um, I know Amazon and even Hasbro Pulse, she's been sold out for a long time. So definitely, definitely need this figure. The likeness is great. Just what a beautiful figure. Uh, rest in peace. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is Rock the Great, a.k.a. The Toy Bookie. My Patreon is below. If anyone wants to subscribe to my Patreon, donations are great. It helps fund this channel. You guys rock. And I got to go. I got to go drink a coffee. I just filmed five toy reviews in a row. I put in my work on this channel. I, I'm going to go have some iced coffee and some uh, dark chocolate Reese's Pieces. But they're not Reese's Pieces, but they're, you know, like buttercups. Peanut butter cups. All right, I'm out of here. Do you like toy photography? Do you like tricks and tips? Then follow me over at, at the toy bookie on Instagram. Bye. I'm just singing at the end of the video because YouTube likes 10 minute videos and if your video doesn't reach 10 minutes it thinks it's not good because it can't put ads on it so this is the video song to elongate it at the end of the video so I could reach 10 minutes in case my video's not 10 minutes this song will help it get there so this is the 10 minute song for YouTube I hope they're happy I hope they're cool dudes this is the 10 10 minute video that YouTube wants so this song it just is meant to elongate the time that someone might watch this video and even if somebody doesn't watch the video the robots over at YouTube will think it's still a 10 minute video so I'm just filling it with content so it could reach 10 minutes videos they're so fun for YouTube they want to put more ads on to my video so they could send it to more people and make more money it actually makes a lot of sense when you actually think of it but then it's making people uh, spend more and more time on their videos and then once they're reaching those 10 minute videos and say they don't have actually 10 minutes worth of stuff to talk about then it, they're just kind of faking and forcing out content that's longer than 10 minutes and it's not really meant to be 10 minutes long so they're just adding a lot of filler so this is kind of that song that it is meant to, with the sole purpose of being filler for YouTube if anyone's actually listening to this I, I kind of I love you bye I'm just singing at the end of the video because YouTube likes 10 minute videos and if your video doesn't reach 10 minutes it thinks it's not good because it can't put ads on it so this is the video song to elongate it at the end of the video so I could reach 10 minutes in case my videos not 10 minutes this song will help it get there so this is the 10 minute song for YouTube I hope 
they're happy. I hope they're cool dudes. This is the 10, 10 minute video that YouTube wants.